Welcome to our five on five. We're pleased to be joined by Larry Graves, the Josephine County Airports Manager. Larry, thanks for coming down. Appreciate it. Thanks, Craig. Thanks for having me. Our pleasure. So tell us, uh, Grants Pass Airport Days, upcoming event. Tell us what's going on. Yeah, you know, it's an opportunity for uh, the public to come in and take a look at uh, the airport itself and see what we have available. We're going to put on a big open house, lots of static aircraft on display. We're going to have flybys. We're going to have um, radio controlled aircraft on a demonstration uh, for the folks. We're bringing in bleachers. We're going to have an area for the crowd to watch where they'll be up and they can see over everybody's heads. And it's going to be a nice time. Okay, and I know you have two airports out there. Which airport is this going to be at? Yeah, we, we do have two airports. This will be at the Grants Pass Airport. It's actually in uh, near Merlin out off of exit 61. Oh, okay, all right. Now, have you ever done something like this before, Larry? Uh, well, we have in the past. Uh, I think the last really big open house that we had was about 2009. And um, people still talk about that with uh, a big smile on their face. And so I, I thought, yeah, it's about time that we did something like that for the community. Let everybody come up and see what's going on at the airport. That's very cool. Okay, and so tell us, when exactly is this event coming up? Well, it will be September 7th and 8th. It's a Saturday and Sunday. It's going to be both days. Uh, we're opening up the gates at 8 o'clock. We're having a pancake breakfast hosted by the Experimental Aircraft Association. Um, and then uh, we'll have uh, radio-controlled flight demonstrations at 10 and again at 2 in the afternoon. Uh, the Rogue Valley Paraglider Association is going to do a demo flight from Walker Peak, which is about three and a half miles to the uh, north of the airport. And they're going to jump off the top of the mountain and then fly down and land uh, right at the center of the airport for the whole crowd to see. So, Love it. Like yeah. that. Okay, now you mentioned experimental aircraft. i got to call you on that. What, sure. what exactly are you talking about with that one? Well, it's an interesting name. Um, the, uh, the FAA, the Federal Aviation Administration, allows people to build their own aircraft. So... I like to call them sport aircraft or custom aircraft, uh, but they're uh, very closely inspected and they're certified by the FAA and they're perfectly safe. And it allows people to express themselves through the medium of building their own airplane and then flying it. Wow, yeah. that sounds pretty cool. I'd love it's to great. see some of those. Very cool. All right, well, we're gonna take a quick break. Much more with Larry in a moment. Stay with us. Welcome back to our 5 on 5. We're going to hear with Larry Graves talking about Grants Pass Airport Days coming up in a little more than a week. Larry, tell us, yep. you're going to let the public get up close to these flying machines, yeah? Yeah, um, we'll have the gates open. We'll have people, uh, they will be able to walk around and actually get close to the full-size aircraft uh, and see them, talk to the owners, talk to the people who built them or to the owner of the aircraft if it's a production airplane. And um, then we're going to have bleachers, as I mentioned, um, mm -hmm. just on the outside of the fence, but it'll raise everybody up and you'll be within, say, about 100 feet of the action with the radio control flyers. Pretty cool. And uh, I wanted to mention the radio control is kind of a special thing out at the airport because we typically cool. do not allow that kind of activity at the airport. So this is... Uh, um, it's going to be a great occasion. Very nice. Yeah. Okay, and again, it's September 7th and 8th, yep. uh, basically all day, really, 8, eight to 5. Yeah. Uh, is there a cost associated with this? Uh, no cost at all. Uh, we want this to be a, a big family affair. We want everyone to come in and have a good time. Um, it'd be great for the kids. Um, one of our businesses on the airport, uh, Pacific Aviation, is going to be offering uh, photo flights. Um, and uh, they, will, they will take you up for about a 20 or 30 minute flight. It's a four fee uh, mm -hmm. cost, but uh, uh, it's pretty reasonable. And uh, you can just sign up at the main office there when you come in and uh, they'll schedule you and take you up. Very it's nice. And, and I know when we're looking at this poster, one of the coolest things I like about this is you have such variety out yeah. there at the airport. Yeah, you know, it's kind of a reflection of the variety of people uh, who are pilots out at the airport. But yeah, we do have... Um, right now we have a helicopter attack base that's set up at Grants Pass Airport and they're out helping mm -hmm. to put out the fires, the Big Windy and the Labrador. And um, that's another aspect of the airport that we want to um, show the public that, hey, uh, we are able to support the, the firefighting efforts. And uh, you'll see these big helicopters out there. With any luck, they'll still be out there. Um, and um, they're quite impressive. Hopefully maybe we can get a couple of them to fly uh, right past the bleachers on their way out to the to the flames. That'd be pretty cool. And, yeah. and I know we see the website on the screen, gpairportdays.org. Larry, great to yeah. meet you. Thanks for coming down. Appreciate Craig, it. Craig, thank you. Our pleasure. Stay with us. We'll be right back.